I have seen a lot of these files lately and a lot of people were asking um, how to unfold these. This is a part that's been done in Katia by the looks of it. Yep, it's a cat part, so it's been done in Katia. Um, and it came in after the import as two separate bodies. You'll have to excuse my movement, I don't have the Space Navigator mouse, so I'll just use the F4 key. The first thing you'll notice if you try to convert it to sheet metal is that Inventor cannot do it because it complains about multiple bodies. So what you want to do is open a new part And then you'll go derive and you'll have to browse for the file. We want to make it one solid body. And we're gonna exclude the body that we don't want. Keep just the one that we want to unfold. And uh, remember to select the create single body option. Uh, Share it with ages, I think that's better. So we have a lot of punches which inventor cannot handle. Uh, we need to remove these before we even try to attempt to do a flat pattern. We also seem to have some rivet nuts or wherever those bosses are which we need to remove. So let's start with a sketch and remove Check the other one as well. Let's go shade it with edges. I think that's better. Let's extrude. Cut. And we removed the bosses. Now, how do we get rid of these punches? We'll use the delete face command. This is Inventor 2014. Um, in 2015, it'll be under modify, I think. Um, in 2014, in 2015, will be under modify, and in 2014 is under surface. So, delete face. Remember to mark the hill on. And then you kind of want to select the faces that you want to remove. In this case, you want to start with the inside faces. So it won't work if you start with the outside ones. Just kind of hold control and pick them all. Now you could click OK right now to kind of see if it's working. But I know that it is, so I'm just going to do all the punches. Yeah. And then I've got two more on the other side. Hold control all the time. And one more. And it creates a flat continuous face. Yeah, do you see that? Oh. So hard without the space navigator. 
and now you want to delete the outside faces so delete heal did I cut them all yep and the other one lost it okay and one more okay and we've got a clean bending profile now let's verify the thickness and make sure that that's actually two millimeters click on that face create flat pattern that's the face that we want to keep flat and now we've got the flat pattern now if you want to export this real quick to DXF, you can just select the face, right click, export face as, or you can save copy as, DXF, same thing. So we've got a nice and clean profile now that we can bend.